Macadamia nuts, often hailed as the world's most luxurious nuts, are prized not only for their rich, buttery flavor, but also for their impressive health benefits. Although native to Australia, the macadamia tree has found a second home in the fertile volcanic soils of Hawaii, where the United States leads the way in macadamia nut production. However, few people understand the complex and meticulous journey these nuts take from planting to packaging. Take a look at the fascinating and intricate process of harvesting and processing macadamia nuts in this video. In the United States, the state of Hawaii dominates the macadamia industry, boasting 16,900 acres of farmland dedicated to the crop. According to the Hawaii Macadamia Association, this represents nearly 90% of the country's total macadamia acreage. Mineral-rich volcanic soil combined with a subtropical climate and steady rainfall creates the ideal environment for growing healthy, productive macadamia orchards. Macadamia trees typically flower from late winter to early spring. The flowers appear in long, elegant clusters and range in color from white to pale pink. Their delicate fragrance attracts bees, which are essential for pollination. After pollination, the seeds take about six to eight months to mature. Initially green and hard-shelled, the outer shell gradually turns brown as the seed matures. Inside, the shell encases a creamy white seed known for its rich flavor and high nutritional value. Traditionally, farmers waited for the seeds to fall naturally before harvesting them by hand, a process that was both labor-intensive and time-consuming. Today, many farms in Hawaii have adopted specialized harvesting machines. Tree shakers are now used to gently shake the tree trunks, encouraging mature seeds to fall efficiently. This technique saves time and increases productivity, allowing farms to harvest hundreds of trees per day. Once the seeds are on the ground, sweepers and collectors come into play. These devices act like giant outdoor vacuum cleaners, quickly collecting the fallen seeds while separating them from leaves, twigs, and other debris. The cleaned seeds are then placed in large containers and transported to nearby processing plants where the next stage of their journey begin. At the processing facility, macadamia nuts are first sorted by size using state-of-the-art sorting equipment. Those still in the shell are cleaned and quality tested, usually in accredited laboratories.
those that do not meet the required standards are rejected, ensuring only premium products continue. Approved nuts are then packed into 25 caggy sacks using automated filling machines with accurate weighing systems. The sealed bags are stored in temperature-controlled warehouses until they are ready for export, with shipping containers carefully sealed to maintain freshness during transit. For raw shelled macadamia nuts, the process is even more rigorous. First comes de-hulling, where the hard green outer shell is removed. Next, the nuts are dried to reduce moisture content, which is an important step in preventing spoilage and extending shelf life. Once dried, the nuts are separated using specialized machinery designed to protect the kernel inside. Dehulling is perhaps the most difficult stage due to the macadamia's exceptionally hard shell, one of the hardest in the nut world. After hulling, the beans are sorted again according to size, color, and quality. Only those that meet strict grading standards are moved to the final stage. The selected beans are then pasteurized to extend their shelf life and ensure safety. Finally, they are packaged in specialized, moisture-proof packaging designed to retain the crunch and flavor of the beans until they are opened by the consumer. Planting typically begins in early spring. The cultivation process begins with the careful selection of healthy seedlings from nurseries. These young plants are nurtured for 6 to 12 months until they develop strong root systems, ensuring a high survival rate when transplanted into the main orchard. Planting is done using specialized machinery that minimizes root damage and ensures precise spacing. Macadamia trees are typically planted 240 to 320 inches apart, allowing enough space for the canopy to spread and for sunlight to reach each tree effectively. Once planted, the trees require constant care. On Hawaiian farms, farmers also prioritize regular pruning to avoid overcrowding the canopy, allowing light to reach all parts of the tree. In addition, weed control is an important aspect with farmers using mulching and mulching techniques to prevent wild weed growth and improve soil fertility. Mature macadamia trees can consume up to 350 liters of water per week, especially during the dry months in Hawaii.
This modern farming process not only saves farmers time, but also results in superior macadamia nut yield and quality. As we wrap up this journey through the macadamia plantations of Hawaii, one thing is clear. Each nut represents years of hard work, innovation, and resilience. The next time you enjoy a macadamia cookie or a spoonful of macadamia butter, remember the story behind it. If you found this farming documentary meaningful, be sure to hit the like button, share your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe to our channel for more in-depth explorations into the world of farming and food production.